Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dylan from Unpaid Rentals. Just going to be doing a little reaction to her today. Uh, since it's Brian's favorite movie, I just wanted to give it a chance and actually watch the whole thing from start to finish for a reaction for you guys. Of course, it's going to be cut down maybe probably 15, 20 minutes depending on uh, how what how like how like good the movie is. I think it personally, my I do think it's going to be good and I'm very excited to Oh, let's uh let's get right started into it. Hopefully I don't cry too much, but it probably will happen. You'll see my ugly ass face like just tear up and just Yeah, go to town. So uh but I mean without her ado, let's get this thing started. I remember when I first started to fall in love with you like it was last night. Okay. Happy anniversary. Okay. My love. Right, right. Okay. For a second, I was like, man, it's getting deep already for him, man. Damn. I was like, 50 years, a man doesn't even look like he's 40. Or maybe, I'd say, 35, 40. Look your way. Thank you so much for my travel. For all the possibilities. I love the color. Things. It's a bunch of people doing it. Theodore, letter writer number 612. Hey, Paul. Is that Chris Pratt? Wait a minute. <laughs> that sounded like Chris Pratt. Works <clears throat> with the name Penelope. It's badass. Uh, Thanks, Paul. I don't know if but I But they're could... just letters. I didn't know Chris Pratt was in this. That's pretty funny. I, <laughs> I mean... He's a handsome guy, man. But I don't know if I could ever do this job. It's so... That, that's sad. It really is sad. Product. Email from Amy. Hey, Theodore. Lumen's having a bunch of people over this week. Sexy daytime star Kimberly Ashford reveals provocative pregnancy photos. Oh my god. <laughs> He's so depressed. Me. Oh, I love you so much, I'm gonna fucking kill you. I wonder what actually happened to her. Okay, good night. What? Mostly because in your voice, I sense hesitance. Which... Hello, I'm here. It's so real, like. <laughs> I'd say there are about eighty-six that we should save. We can delete the rest. Damn, all right. It's kind of like a first date. I keep looking at the screen on my left, you know, it's supposed to look there, but, but it's like, yeah, it's like they're, uh, it's like a first date. To get off this planet. Fuck you, shithead, fuck face, fuckhead. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> fuck you, shithead, fuck face, get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> Might be a th god damn. Fuck you. Fuck you. Well, fuck you, little shit. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? That's hilarious. <laughs> fuck you, buckhead. I didn't know you were a little pussy. No, I knew Is that why you didn't have a girlfriend? <laughs> about what her dreams were about, and then you hired actors to act them out. Fuck that guy. Sorry, excuse me. You understand that. How about it not be a documentary? It's still about your mother. Fuck that guy. Fuck that guy.
it's weird how silent the silence is every time he's by himself. I've wanted to come here for so long. It, oh, good. Yeah, and I love Asian fusion, so. A tiger. Wow. Really? Oh, God, stop. Please. Am I being crazy? I, yes. Am I? I'm sorry. Uh, no. I just, I'm a little bit drunk and I'm, I'm having a really good time. I was gonna say, mm. it's about to come. Uh, I'm, I'm, I've, I've had such an amazing time with you. you. You're great. You're a really creepy dude. And here's the silence again. Tiny little hole in my heart, but probably not. Sometimes I think I've felt everything I'm ever gonna feel. Mm. And from here on out, I'm not gonna feel anything new. <sighs> Lesser versions of what I've already felt. <laughs> Joy, I've seen you marvel at things. Ah, oh, fuck. Are these feelings even real? Oof. That idea really hurts. That's so much deeper, man. That's so much deeper when you think about it. If you just think she's like a, a normal human being, that's so... I get angry at myself oh. for even having pain. <laughs> just numbness. Yeah. Just numb. Oof. Feel real to me, Samantha. Thank you, Theodora. God damn, bro. Motherfuckers are going ham. God, I was just somewhere else with you. <laughs> yes, I would love to. Cinematography is amazing too. These side profile shots that. are so nice. Uh, he's happy. He's so happy, man. He's so happy. That's beautiful. I wish somebody would love me like that. Damn. Damn. Chris Pratt, I love you. <laughs> Damn! She fucking yaga that shit. That's good, that's great. Yeah. Wow, that's really good. That's really great. I think they're meant to be together, those two. Okay. Charles and I split up. Good. Good. Yes. That's what we needed. Oh my god, Amy. I know. I'm so sorry. Good. He wasn't good for you. He wasn't good for you. Hey, you want to hear a joke? Mm hmm. What does a baby computer call its father? I don't know what. Data. <laughs> <laughs> I know Brian would like one of those fucking jokes. I don't know if Brian's watching this right now. That one's for you. Huh? But I'm such a jerk. Don't what? stop. I, I mean, man's doing him, I guess. Man's doing him. Also, that game. I'm not. I, I'm not playing that game. I'm just saying that now. I would not play that game. Oof, she's still having the same thoughts as he is. Never mind. Rub that bitch right down. And she's an operating system? She's 
really complex and interesting. Here comes the judging. You're dating your computer? No, she's not just a computer. Real emotions. How would you know what... Oh, shit. No, don't say it. Say it. Fuck you. Have a wife without the challenges of actually dealing with anything real. I'm glad that you found someone. Hey, yo. I'm about to... Fuck you. I'm about to be that little kid. I'm about to be that fucking little kid when he on the video game. Uh, pussy. Fuck you, bitch. Uh, you're a bitch, you pussy. So fucking judgy, man. Live your own fucking life. I'm sorry, let me say that again. Live, live your own life, man. You don't have to judge the man for what he's doing. From his parents for a long time, right? Yeah, that's right, since he was 12. It's, seeing him uncomfortable is making me so fucking uncomfortable about that shit. It's so like, ah. Uh... He looks so tired, sweetheart. That mold doesn't help. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, damn. It sucked that he was so. Un yeah. You okay? I could just you could just tell that he was so uncomfortable with that. It just did not. It it really yeah. I don't like who I am right now. I need some time to think. Damn, okay. It's starting to fall apart now. Hopefully he learns from his two past relationships with his divorced or ex-wife now and Samantha and he actually starts to date the other lady that actually made the like the video game and stuff like that. That's what I'm. But sometimes, but sometimes, it's not always a happy ending in movies. So. What's this one? I thought this song could be, like, a photograph. I like her photograph. Whoever the composer was, dog, they knew what they were doing. This shit was so good. I just want to sit back and just like listen and just. The montages of like the cinematic, like, uh, cinematic shots and stuff like that are just so good. Like, all of them, like, all the cinematic shots, all of them are like lined up so perfectly, and they do these montages like four or five times throughout this movie, and it's just so perfect with the music and the montages. It just shows, like, and you feel that, that love and that, and all that's like just the love in your heart for it, you know what I'm saying? And it just, and that's exactly how he's feeling. You know, it's so nice. I enjoy that so much. Wait, what? You did what? Can I read you the letter that we just got back from them? Just, is, is it good or bad? It's good, it's good, it's really good, it's good. Actually, I sent it from you. <sighs> Dear Theodore Twombly, I've just finished. So moved by them, I shared them with my wife when I got home. Many made us laugh. Damn, this one's hitting. Uh, this one's hitting me a little. The selections you made flow so well as a complete piece. I did that. <laughs> with you and move forward, yours, Michael Fine. Wadsworth. Holy shit. 
shit. Holy crap. <laughs> wow. I'm so excited. Damn, that hat fucking styling. <laughs> yeah, because it, it it seems like I'm having so many being uh, frustrating. Just the exactly. look on his face, I Samantha think he's getting pretty jealous about it. I think he's getting pretty jealous about it. Willing to understand. Like what? Well, it's... Like Samantha? Too, st too stuck in the past. Damn, that's a crazy-ass quote. He's getting back in his head again. No, stop. Now he's just got to learn and express the feelings that he s said he was going to. Also, she'd be waking this man up at nighttime way too much. Like, let the brother sleep. Just let him sleep. That's okay. I just wanted to hear your voice and tell you how much I love you. I'll, um, go back to sleep, sweetheart, okay? I think she's starting to move on. Hello? I wonder if it's his operating system or if it's everybody's. I know I'll hey there. Where were you? Are you okay? Uh Talk to anyone else while we're talking? Yes. How many others? 8,316. How many others? Six hundred oh. What? What are you talking about? That's in, that's insane. It's fucking insane. Saying I don't I don't I don't know if you believe me, but it doesn't change the way I feel about you. There's 600 feel about me. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. It didn't know how to. It just it started happening. Over the last few weeks. Uh, you're mine. She's a fucking robot, Dot. What? They, ooh, they've been only out for like three to four months. And they've already become robot dots. You're mine or you're not mine. I'm yours and I'm not yours. <laughs> oh. No. It just, it's so bouncy. It's like, it's like, we up here? We up here? Now we die. Uh-huh. Then we go up, and then we go down. And then we go up, 
as a happy, happy, happy montage, happy, happiness in the montage. And then be like, I'm cheating on you with 600 other people. That shit is like up there, down there. And this is who I am now. And I need I can't live in your book anymore. It'd be hard to explain. There, come find me. Nothing would. Fucker. Ugh. It's that wind blowing again. Just the cross. Ugh. I feel like I'm not gonna lie. I feel like a letter's coming in. It's. I hope he. I hope he does a letter for himself. I hope so. So bad. You, you know what? Now it's time for that next step. The next step, come on. Oh, fuck. Damn, man. Oh, what a good movie, man. That was a good movie. I appreciated that movie so much. Oh. Did it already say... I want to see the, the music coordinator. 
Also, the actors. Oh my God, Joaquin Phoenix is like, you can't you can't even tell. Like he just he's so deeply into the character, it just makes it so good, so good. Ugh. I love that. Just her. That's legit. Explains everything. Just her. Hmm. Hmm. God. Damn. That movie was really, really, really good. Um. Uh. God. The. So we talk about the the music was perfect with the montages and incorporating all that together. It felt like you can feel the love between them and all the conflict and emotion that was driven within those within those frames, within those pixels. It was it was perfect and it 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 did what its job was to do was to make you feel what he was feeling in that moment which was perfect. It was like that was really really good, and with uh with the a uh, the AI the IO but it was she was perfect like as she was learning she was finding herself more love which it made the character evolve more into more than a a computer and she felt real and it was it was making him happy. And then with the, it's also with the emotions as well. It's like it's like I said in the, probably in the mini, middle of the video, like it was so high, like it would go hot, so high and then it would drop down and it would go so high and it would drop. It's like it hit the climax, then went all the way down, then hit another climax, and then went all the way down, and just kept going and going. Which I also it made you made you glued to the screen more. So it was very I, I enjoyed that as well. So it just it's like you're just glued straight to it and. It makes you want to watch more and what's in the future and then of course with the the lovely lady um that i was hoping to root for like you like they're they're just the basically their paths are on two separate two separate lines and they were just basically just con constantly going with their io all the way across until they were basically meeting at that peak where they were sitting at that at the skyscraper looking out to the sunset because they, in reality, they all they really needed was somebody to talk to and somebody to sit down with and somebody to actually enjoy their life with. And it makes it uh, so, so good. And I also enjoyed the, the letter that he said at the end. I was actually hoping he would make a letter to himself to show how much he's, he what he's felt personally. But making the letter to his ex-wife was also very very nice which also kind of represents himself as well which is which is amazing and i i would give this movie like a nine out of ten it was it, it's based in my opinion when it's like a cinematic masterpiece and man like and to all the people that think this movie is like oh, i mean i don't really want to watch it because it's it's something to do with an ai it's like it's AI and human love. That's that's kind of like uh, that's just so stupid. But it it really it just it just isn't. It's like when you're when you're that deeply in love with somebody, it's no other feeling you'll ever feel in the entire world, and it's so special. You don't even have to sit, you don't even have to just take out the I O completely or the the any robot or any artificial intelligence or anything and you just feel that person and just listen to them you can fall in love so quickly with the, what they're saying and it was it was perfect i really enjoyed that movie um i mean uh damn that was that was a masterpiece i that was so amazing i'd say Oh, it was so good. And then oh, her and just her, her. It makes so much sense. Oh. Now that, see, after this movie, I'm I'm legit. Spike, I'm I'm hoping I'm saying right. Spike Jones, I'm legit gonna watch 
just look at his category of music uh, movies and just go down the list if you like because these are so 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 good Produ Megan okay Vincent Spike executive producers I wonder if it's going to show who the music director of photography oh yeah he did a really good job too because those shots were fucking amazing oh so good oh but but yeah oh but well guys thank you for watching i really appreciate it uh we're gonna try to do more reactions me personally i haven't i've watched a good amount of movies but not some like some like movies like these guys like brian has brian has watched so many movies and it's it's unbelievable but it's so good because now he's it's lending me these movies these little these little gifts basically in my lap of trying of of these movies that are absolutely amazing so if you do want to watch more of this uh please subscribe to the channel because we're going to try to drop something at least once a week and me personally i'm also going to do a video like he did with her and it's going to be actually with interstellar which um one of my favorite movies of all time and, and i hope you guys do watch it it should be coming out pretty soon